Hey, what's up guys, Winston here, and today we'll be taking a quick look at the ASRock Z590 PG Veloster. This motherboard uses Intel's Z590 chipset and is compatible with all of the latest Intel processors, including the 11th gen Rock Lake, as well as the previous 10th gen Comet Lake. It supports memory speeds of up to DDR4 4800OC and you get three PCIe x16 steel slots, two of those support PCI4. For connectivity it comes with the killer E3100G 2.5 gigabit LAN as well as the killer 1675X supporting the Wi-Fi 6. What's interesting about these two is that you can use the Double Shot Pro feature from Killer that allows you to combine the two to give you double the speed and we'll cover that topic in our next video. ASRock have added some new features with this motherboard including the CPU Direct Source LAN, the Lightning Gaming Ports as well as ASRock's graphics card holder. And as usual it comes with all of ASRock's unique features including Dr. Moss, the Super Alloy, the 14 phase power design, the 7.1 HD Nahimic audio as well as ASRock's Polychrome Sync. It will be interesting to see how this motherboard will perform against others that we've tested in the past. To test this motherboard, we'll be installing the Intel Core i9 11 900K processor along with some nice DDR4 RAM as well as a GeForce RTX 2080. So uh, let's get cracking and before we do that, let's do a quick unboxing and we'll see you in a bit. Alright, let's do a quick unboxing of the ASRock Z590 PG Veloster. And uh, yeah, let's take a look inside the box. All right, let's take a look inside. All right, we have a tray here with the motherboard itself. We'll take a look at that in a sec. Let's have a look at the accessories inside. All right, we have the uh, instruction manual. We also have the uh, software setup guide. We have a, a bunch of uh, uh, PG Veloster Phantom Gaming stickers. We have the postcard from ASRock Phantom Gaming. We have a driver's disc. We have uh, Velcro cable ties, well nice. This is the graphics card holder, which is pretty unique for ASRock. That uh, comes included. All right, we have uh, SATA cables. There's two packs, two packs of two SATA cables. We have the uh, Wi-Fi antennas. There's two of them for your Wi-Fi six. There's also a USB bracket, extra USB ports. And there's also an active fan here. Hmm, pretty interesting. I guess that cools the chipset. There's also a keyring. Keyring and a, a load of uh, M.2 this screws. There's three of them there, three sets. And that's pretty much it for the accessories. Let's take a look at the motherboard now. Here we have the uh, ASRock Z590 PG Veloster motherboard. Looks fairly decent. We'll start off the top right here. Here we have the two 8-pin uh, power connectors for your motherboard. 
That's a nice heat shield here, heat sink for your VRMs, very nice. Fan headers at the top here. We also have uh, RGB, ARGB and uh, standard RGB headers right here. There's your on off switches and the reset. I like these. And then we have the standard 24 pin ETX power right here. All right. And now we have the four dim slots, the DR4 uh, 4800 support there, we'll see. There's your socket there, the LGA 1200 socket for your processor. All right. Moving on here, we have um, six SATA ports for your hard drives, USB connected right here, USB 3. Please see mouse button right here, and of course, diagnostic LEDs. And more fan headers, and more RGB headers. All right, this is interesting. You can see the chipset right here. And it's got this little window and it's kind of open, which is quite unique. All right, and you have three heat shields, uh, full cover heat shields there for your M.2 SSDs. And then have a look at the uh, PCIe slots. We have uh, three steel slots, time 16 slots here. Uh, two of these are PCIe 4, and that's the standard PCIe 3. You have also one times PCIe slots there. All right, let's look at the I.O. We'll start off over here. We have the display port, HDMI, and uh, four USB 3.2s here. You have the Gigabit LAN from Intel, more USB 3.2s, more USBs in here, and this is the 2.5 Gigabit LAN killer LAN, and the Wi-Fi 6, the killer Wi-Fi 6 there. USB 3.2, and of course the uh, uh, USB-C there connector, and the array of audio connectors. Okay, and the hood is actually surrounded with a nice kind of uh, design here. Azrock logo, Phantom Gaming, Z590, and also an, adver an active fan inside here, which is unique. Pretty decent. This motherboard has a ton of fan he headers, which is uh, pretty interesting. But yeah, um, so we'll be mounting an Intel Core i9 11900K processor in here along with some nice DDR4 RAM and uh, of course a GeForce RTX uh, 2080 to test this motherboard. All right, so that was a quick unboxing of the ASRock Z590 PG Velocity motherboard. PG Velasta is the natural successor to ASRock's previous generation of the Z490 series of motherboards. Improvements include native support for PCIe 4 standards both on the PCIe X16 steel slots and the Hyper M.2 for SSDs. You also get better XMP profiles as well as support for high memory speeds. Network connectivity have also been upgraded too. You now get the killer 2.5 gigabit LAN and the killer Wi-Fi 6. Not to mention all the rest, which includes the ASRock Super Alloy, Dr. Moss, 14-phase power design, the 7.1 HC Nahemic Audio, and of course, ASRock's Polychrome Sync. As far as features are concerned, the ASRock Z590 PG Veloster is seriously loaded. And when it comes to performance, 
The uh, Z590P G Veloster produced some very good results in all of our benchmarks, including a PC Mark 10 score of uh, 8,296 and a Pass Mark 9 score of uh, 8,931. For Port Royal, we got a score of uh, 6,613 with a DLSS score of uh, 42.86 frames per second. For Time Spy and Fire Strike, we got excellent scores of 11,229 and 24,188 respectively. So all in all, I'm more than pleased with the overall performance and results. ASRock informed us that they've included a new special feature by Killer called the Double Shot Pro. It combines the speeds of both the onboard Killer 2.5 gigabit LAN as well as the Killer Wi-Fi 6, giving you a maximum speed of 4.9 gigabits per second. For more details, you can check out the full article on our website. As I said before, the ASRock Z590 PG Veloster is a fantastic motherboard that's absolutely packed with some great features. If you're building a high-end enthusiast gaming system based on the Intel 11th Gen Rocket Lake processor, then you have to take a look at this motherboard. You can check out the full review on our website at fuckit.com. And there you have it, that was a quick look at the ASRock Z590 PG Veloster motherboard featuring Intel Z590 chipset and supports all of the latest Intel 11th gen processors. It offers excellent performance as well as a ton of features which is perfect for enthusiasts and gamers alike. Hope you enjoyed this video, give us a like and uh, leave a comment down below. Don't forget you can actually buy this via the links in the description and of course visit our website for more news, reviews and hot tips. Oh yeah, hit the subscribe button for more. Until next time, this is Winston for FunkyGit.com.